Here we are, Lake Maggie Ore. It's really nice, very, very quiet. Um, yeah. Been travelling for how many hours today? Not too many. Four? Mm. Four hours. Look at these beauties. I said, look, there's an Italian swan and it's goslings. And here comes Father Swan too. Yeah, they bite. So yeah, here we are. Nice view of this lake. We did have a bit of a hiccup. Karen pointed at a sign. And there's me thinking I've got to turn right. So we turn right and we was, we was about 50 yards away. Um, so we took this turn in and we ended up getting further and further and further away. Every time we went to take turning to go back onto the right road again, <laughs> there was a dead end or they was doing road works and they're saying go through these big, bloody yeah, tiny big. places. It's like maximum of two and a half tons and like maximum height as well. God, we're in Italy now. But we made it. I nearly cried. But I'm fine now. Two beers deep. Shut up, dogs. Erased. So yeah, Lake Maggie Ore. You think we should um, plug the electric in? You can, it's available. I'll do it in a minute. You always do it. Well, I'm busy cooking, aren't I? Oh, it's me. So we're emptying the toilet late at night, you can only do it in the men's, and it's Karen's job, so I'm making her do a, a late night shit stalk. <laughs> there we go, get in there, close the door behind you, don't let anyone see you. Mum says we can sit down tonight and have a drink and relax. Well, That'd be Mom nice. So we had a whole bottle of rum when we left home. Yes we did. So I'd suggest that Adam's already sat down and enjoyed himself and had a... Had a relax. Yes, I have. Cheers, Mum. <laughs> Cheers, Mum. What's this town called? Baniva. Baniva. Here we are in Baniba. It's about 30 today down here. It's supposed to be a thunderstorm tonight. Possibly. Maybe just a bit of rain. It's kind of grey up there. The sun's still shining. <sighs> so we're here for two nights. We've already been here one. Um, yeah, nice little town. Ooh. Excited face. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go again, sit 
people in chairs over there and get something to eat. Okay. One of these. Sounds good. Isn't it? Get your, get your gelato and pizza and drink Peroni and Prosecco. And yeah, let's do it. Bloody Italian. Why not? Obviously, I've gone straight to the alcohol. That's more important. Mm. Why a litre? Mm. <laughs> a litre of Prosecco? Yeah. Don't you like a litre of Prosecco? Yeah. It's a very lovely restaurant. Not a bad view. Safe sex on the beach. <laughs> what I do. That's what it's all about, isn't it? Safety first. That's what I say. Hello. Might as well have pizza as I'm in Italy. My mates would love it here. Tons of birds. So, when you ask for the feel, in Italy it's on the toe. How am I, I going to remember that or say that right? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so that's not too bad. Two huge pizzas. Um, two drinks each. Two Proseccos, two beers. 32 euros. Happy days. Right, I gotta put this away otherwise I won't be enjoying it. This is all for you lot, you know. So this place is called Bovino and it's really pretty. Look at this. That's nothing. Look at this. stumbled across this place, okay, didn't we? He said, I want to go to a lake, let's go there. It's like a pin in the map. Yeah. And now I'm staying. Um, Karen's picking up the local lingo. Mm. I'm not. I can't decide whether to speak French, speak English. <laughs> can't even speak my own language. I speak a conto. That's the only word I know so far, it's conto. <laughs> Uh, I'm sure I'll get that wrong at the time. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, look at the water! Isn't that nice? I might jump in in a bit. But yeah, this is beautiful. There's like the Italian Alcatraz out there. Can lock me up, mate. I'll be happy there. Yeah, the water was like crystal clear. There's like flotsam and jetsam in there, but it's all plants and stuff. It's nothing dirty, apart from maybe that pack of crisps I've just seen over there. But yeah, we'd highly recommend this place, Cal, wouldn't we? We're staying. Yeah. Could I say that? It's nice knowing you guys, but <laughs> we're we're here for good. Cheers and gone.
last night in Bovino. Um, apparently there's uh, rain coming in tomorrow. So we're just having a barbie. Gonna cook some snakes. Um, and tomorrow, we're off the Lake Garda. Aren't we? Because <laughs> the weather's nice there. So. We're getting closer to Prosecco Road. Yeah. That's a little uh, taster for you. Prosecco Road. Look it up. Because we'll be there at some point. You recommend it to park before you adventure down Prosecco Road. Oh, really? Park for the night. Yeah, that does sound like a good idea. Like <laughs> <laughs> a good day out. That's a hell of a pub crawl, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, check it out, Prosecco Road. We're off there. Um, don't know how much vlogging's going to be done there, to be honest. I guarantee what it'll be will be funny. <laughs> if it's not funny to you, it'll be funny to us. <laughs> At the time, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> As it's the last night, a little Barbie, just smoking some sausages and some apple wood chips, low and slow. So, watching this reminds me of um, Austin Powers. Well, they're in the tent and the light shone now. <laughs> so anime is just going to drop his huge slong on the floor. <laughs> yeah, these guys have been sitting up this tent for about five hours now. And at every moment of the day, I've thought to myself, should I go and help them put it up or should I do it for them? And then I thought, nah. <laughs> Morning. Uh, today we're moving off. It's very gray out there. Let's see. It was 33, 31, 33 yesterday. And uh, we had our fans on. And then the, the French guy next to us told us to turn our fans off. So we turned them down, we didn't turn them off. But this morning, Karma has delivered him a little, uh, a little message. I don't know if you can see it just there. That's his rubbish, which has been pecked to death by a seagull. <laughs> <laughs> Bye -bye.